Tens of thousands of dollars have gone into Medford schools this summer to ensure children have safe drinking water this school year. At a board meeting tonight, a presentation outlined the steps taken after two schools tested positive for high levels of lead. NBC5's Natalie Weber was at that meeting and she joins us live at the school district's headquarters tonight with more. Natalie. Art, the school district originally budgeted $10,000 for the lead testing, but tonight we learned they actually spent nearly $45,000 just to make sure their schools are lead free this year. Actually, they just installed two new ones, which allow you to fill your water bottle up. Stephen Richmond is talking about the drinking fountains at South Medford High School. And after recent lead testing over the summer, he's not afraid to use them. Based on some recent events up in Portland and some other parts of the country where lead was found, um, kind of widespread cases in, in other areas, we decided to up our game and basically test every single fixture for com consumption in every single school. Surprisingly, the two newly remodeled elementary schools, Roosevelt and Jackson, both had elevated lead levels in 73 to 80% of the fixtures tested. We shut off the water right away and we provided bottled water. Nearly every fixture was replaced in the two schools, along with a few others on different campuses. Even those that we didn't maybe necessarily need to, we just wanted to err on the side of caution. NBC5 News learned those replacements, plumbing and testing added up to nearly $45,000. Money that came from the general fund that the school district is hoping to get back. The Oregon School Board Association may be asking the legislature to provide some of that funding for districts. In the meantime, lead levels are where they should be and Richmond is grateful. It made me nervous that there was a problem, but it, it definitely helped the fact that they addressed that very, very quickly. And um, it makes me feel safe being in my own school. The school board has until October 1st to submit a lead testing report to the Oregon Board of Education. They also plan to discuss the frequency with which they'll lead test in the future at upcoming board meetings. Live in Medford, Natalie Weber, NBC5 News.